Hey everyone, Techie 101 here in my studio slash closet. <laughs> I um, zoomed out a little bit to actually show you what is in here. This is pretty basic room here. It's got backdrop and a blanket with tape and my suit and a table that I set my laptop on during the reviews and have a little mouse here to control it. Um, this video is a... Um, it's an introduction to me. I did one of these before, way back in 2009 when I started the channel. I started with uh, video game reviews of this old game for PlayStation. It was called Medieval. Uh, it was for the original PlayStation back in 96. And uh, the, the funny thing is, uh, when I started with that, I didn't have, I didn't know how to record footage off the TV. And I just recorded myself playing. So for like 10 videos, you got nothing but just me playing the game. You didn't actually see the TV. It's like, oh, man, did you see that demon? Oh, man, I wish you could see that demon that I'm fighting right now. No, I, I eventually put the camera, I just, like, faced the camera directly at the TV, and, you know, it was horrible quality, but I did that. Um, I guess I do, I would do a new one, because most people that are coming to my channel recently are just because of my manga reviews, and they're not so much paying attention, and, and, and you could go back and watch my old stuff, but I really don't, I can't, really, I can't watch myself, because back in my original reviews I just got my braces in. I got my braces on like a month before that and I was firing all my S's and eighth sounds. You know I could not talk straight and plus my voice was squeaky. I mean it's still squeaky now but it was more squeaky back then. Could not say any S's or S's. Cesare Snape is the headmaster of Slytherin House. Yeah I'm going to Harry Potter tonight. I'm really looking forward to that too. Uh, I, might, uh, might, I, I might actually make a review of that. I mean, I know everyone and his mother is going to make a review of Harry Potter. I mean, tomorrow, uh, like around 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, tomorrow, it's going to be like, Harry Potter 7 review, Harry Potter 7 review, Harry Potter 7 review. 7 part 2, sorry. But, yeah. Um, here's the deal with the uh, manga reviews. Um, I guess I'll just keep doing what I want now. Um, I will do a couple more things. I'm not just going to, because I really like doing it. I really do. I mean, it's something I enjoy. I actually look forward to coming down here every week in this incredibly hot room, because this room has no insulation, and whatever temperature it is outside, it is in here, and it's 80 degrees usually, so that's usually 80 degrees is the norm, and plus I'm in a suit which has no breathability whatso freaking ever. Sometimes it's difficult. Uh, but this week I, I did... Uh, this week I was going to do all three at once, and it usually takes me about 40 minutes to do everything, because each review is about 10 minutes. The way it takes me to record, each review is probably around 15 to 17 minutes. And then I edit it down, because what happens is if I'm talking up here and I just slur my words, I usually repeat the scene over and over again. Like uh, the last Bleach review I did, I forgot to edit out a scene where I was... Uh, it was the scene where Ginjo went into the uh, mansion and the chandelier fell in front of him. And I forgot to edit out the parts where I messed up on that, on saying that, and I had to repeat myself like four times. I forgot to edit that out, sorry. But that's usually how it goes. So I'm in here for a good, you know, 40 minutes at a time recording these manga reviews. And uh, I was in here this week, and I did one piece. I did one piece first. And I thought, okay, I can do this. I can do this. A little hot, I'm good. I got a drink. I usually keep a drink on the table right there. I don't know if you can see it. Um... I did Naruto, and after that, after Naruto, I was done. I was in here for maybe 30 minutes. I was dead. I could not, I could not do it for the third time. I was going to, like, you know, <coughs> it's just too uncomfortable. So I went upstairs, edited the other two, and then I did the bleach later. Um, I don't like doing it like that because I like to do everything right away, but, you know, what, whatever works. I'm not going to, it's hard to keep, because you know how I do reviews. I'm up here, you know, moving my arms around, keeping the energy up. I, you know... I like to have my little hand gestures in motion. I don't like to keep it, like, bland, like... Ichigo stared at Tsukushima in a very angry stare. He charged at him, yelling, Tsukushima, at the top of his lungs, and it seemed to unhinge his jaw. That was weird, wasn't it? Yeah, but, yeah, I like to keep a certain level of energy up, and that's hard to do when it's this hot in the room and I'm in the suit. But, um... Yeah. Uh, but aside from that, I'm gonna also start doing, uh, anime reviews. Uh, on what? I don't know yet. And every time I say I'm going to do something, I usually never do it. I said I was going to start reviewing Toriko. One chapter of Toriko I reviewed. And, okay, to be completely conceitedly honest with you, I don't like the recent Toriko chapters. And that's the reason I didn't review them. I don't like to be like that. I don't like to be like, oh, the reason I'm not reviewing it is just because I don't like them. 
I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know what is. I like the, the last arc in the pyramid. That was freaking awesome. Zebra was awesome. I miss him. They need to bring him back as soon as possible. But I love that arc so much. That's what, we got, that's what got me so hyped to review Torco. First Torco review I did, they were hunting for those apples. And I'm like, okay, okay. It's, it's not as exciting as shooting and killing a giant sphinx the size of a freaking barn. But okay. It's alright. And then the next chapter was... The next chapter sucked. It was about the, it was about a guy who wanted to sell an egg, and 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 usually how Torco works is they usually go after the creature. They got the creature the same chapter or the ingredient the same chapter is introduced. You don't do that. I mean, yeah, they did that with the surprise apple too, but they actually had to work to collect the surprise apple. The egg was just like, oh yeah, the egg you're looking for. It's right under here. You can have it. Not how you do it. This chapter right now. Uh, it's starting, and they're searching for a fish in this waterfall. It's starting to look okay. The only problem is, in this arc, Toriko's teamed up with Sunny, and I really don't like Sunny. Not my favorite character. It goes Toriko, then... Actually, it might, it might be Zebra. Zebra might, might be my favorite. So let's go Zebra, Toriko, Coco, then Sunny. Don't like Sunny. He's, he's just a pretentious... I just don't like characters like that. Anytime in a shonen manga, when there's a character that... There's always one obsessed with beauty or, or elegance, and I just don't like them. I don't. But anyway, um, you know, if that arc gets better, I might start redoing that. But as for anime reviews, um, I have a couple series on DVD, which I might do. I have Elf and Lead, have uh, Fooly Cooly, which I actually just bought the uh, DVD for Fooly, the re-released Fooly Cooly, because I bought the original box set, like with the comic book and all the, you know, the, the I loved it. It was six episode series. They put two episodes on every disc. I bought that back in 2005. Uh, I broke the first disc, and I think to replace it, like the, like the first disc alone was like $30. It was like really rare. Then I was walking to Walmart. They sold the whole series on one disc because I bought that. So that's the only anime I bought twice. It's great, great anime. And what else do I have? Um, uh, I have Bleach, Naruto, One Piece. I have, you know, those series on DVD. Death Note, have that. Um, I don't know if I might do a review of Death Note or not, because that's just like, it's pretty much up there with just, you know, One Piece. Like, if, if Death Note was still a serialized manga, I probably still would, I would be reviewing that. That'd be like the big four for me, probably, but, yeah. Um, and as with the movies, too, like, I, like I said, I might do a Harry Potter movie review tomorrow. I don't know. Um, oh, and I don't know if you, I don't know if you're thinking, yeah. I don't know if you can see these guys in frame, my little Santas there. This is the storage room. This is where I'll show you, actually. This is... Look at this. This is where we keep all our... This is what I'm... Yeah. Cr Christmas stuff all piled into one corner. Um, my tripod broke. Yeah, I had that, but that broke. So, this is what I'm left with. Just balancing it on a... It's a... Wait a minute, I'm trying to... I'm wedging the camera between a VHS tape cover of Airbud to get it to, to get it to angle down. Because if I stay... If, I, if, it, um, if the camera goes straight at me, you won't be able to see the floor or anything. I don't know why. But, uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, aside from everything else, but, uh, yeah, I think I said everything I wanted to say here. Um, thank you guys so much for the positive comments. You guys have been awesome. You know, everybody. I can't even remember all your names because there's been so many that have been giving me positive comments. When I started doing this YouTube channel back in 2009, the, the, the medieval, the video game reviews in general, what happened was I would barely crack, like, I don't know, 50, 60 views on all of them. That, that's like, you know, that this video's been out for like a month. I only have like 50 views on it. These manga reviews, they're cracking 100, 200 views uh, uh, every time I have a week, every time I release them. I know, that's still not that great. You know, you compare them to other videos on YouTube. That's, that's 200 views. That, that's, that's shit. That's nothing. But for me, big deal. That's four times what I usually get on my reviews. So that's a big deal. Um, comments. You know, I would usually get like one or two comments a month. You know, and most of them would be negative. Because I have done a few reviews where, you know, most people just poke fun at stupid shit like trolls and stuff. But, you know, basically... Um, I was very unrecognized on YouTube, and I like the, I'm still unrecognized. I really don't think I'm a big shot yet. But you know, this is this is this is what I like to do. I like to do this bigger audience for manga reviews. You know, because it's current. I keep it going. I mean, better than doing reviews for a video game that was released. You know, uh, 15 years ago. You know, this is something I get to update every week. Comments are going in. I don't think I've gotten one dislike on my manga reviews yet. I'm not saying it's going to stay like that forever. I'm not getting conceited. But I think I'm doing a pretty good job so far. So I'm going to keep it like this. I'm going to start doing some new stuff. Thank you so much for the positive comments, everyone. I went up 14 subscribers in two weeks. 
I also know that's not a big deal when you look at other channels, but for me, when you get like one or two subscribers every month or two, that's that's a big thing for me. That it really is. I like that this. I like where this is going. I really do. I really hope I can become partner doing this. If I could get, if I could make money off reviewing uh, stories about ninjas in orange jumpsuits and people, which you know, uh, an author that cuts people's arm off every single arc, only to have it reattached the next chapter. If I could make money off that, that, making fun of that, that would be fun. That would be fun for me. Um, yeah. So, everyone, just thank you so much. This is Techie 101. My name's Matt. Call me that, I guess. I don't care. Uh, thank you so much for everything. Um, signing out. A